Hey lovely people, welcome back once again to another episode of Stitches Viz Collection. I'm Miss Stitches. Today in this video, I'm going to share with you how to make this easy and simple picture frame or photo frame. Before we start, make sure you subscribe to my channel and hit the bell button. Let's get started. Materials needed. So, I have a video of how to make the beaded mat which is the um, back side of the frame we are about to do so i'm going to drop the link below so you can watch and follow up okay so i'm done with the um, back of the frame so this side is 10 i did 10 steps and then the other side is 13 so 13 is to 10 so this is the size for the back of the um photo frame so to continue weaving i already have my beads in this bead so we are going to weave towards this side so on this fish line you pick three beads fix on the left fish line and then you cross with the third bead so you fix two on the left fish line then you cross with the third bead using the right fish line so you cross it out and then with the right fish line you go through the next bead then you go on and pick two beads fix one on the left fish line then you cross with the second bead so you fix one on the left fish line then you cross with the second bead so you cross it out also then with the right fish line you go through the next bead again then you still pick two beads fix on the left fish line then you cross with the second bead cross with the second bead and then with the right fish line you go through the next bead again then you pick two beads fix on the left fish line then you cross with the right fish line so if you are comfortable with fixing the beads on the left sorry on the right fish line you can go on and do it as such so you now pick the beads fix on your right fish and then you cross with the left fish line rather but because i'm okay with my um left fish line so i pick the beads and then cross with my right fish line so you go on and weave with the same method So when you get to the last bead, you go through that bead and then you still pick two beads fixed on the left fish line. Then you cross with the second bead using the right fish line. You cross it out and then with the right fish line, you go through the next bead, the next one bead. Then you still pick two beads fixed on the left fish line. Then you cross with the right fish line. Then you cross it out. And then with the right fish line, you go through the next bead again. Then after you still pick two beads fixed on the left fish line, then you cross with the right fish line. You cross with the second bead using the right fish line. Then you go on and weave with the same method till you get to the end. So we are weaving to this end. You weave to this end. 
so we have it now and this is why you should get if you're on the right track or you are following the correct process so we are done with it and then we left this side because that's where we are going to pass the picture through so you weave the sides and then leave the last side so going on on this fish line you pick three beads fix two and then you cross with the third bead so you fix two beads on the left fish line then you cross with the third bead so we are done with the sides of the um, frame and then we are now weaving the top so this is the top side we are weaving now so with the right fish line you go through the next bead then you pick two beads fix on the left fish line you fix one on the left fish line then you cross with the second bead so you pick two beads fix one on the left fish line then you cross with the second bead then with the right fish line you go through the next bead again then you still go on and pick two beads fix on the right fish sorry fix on the left fish line then you cross with the um, second bead using the right fish line then you go through the next bead then you go on and pick two beads again fix on the left fish line then you cross with the right fish line which is using the second bead then you go on and weave with the same method So when you get to the last end, you go through the next two beads. So the next two beads, that's what you go through now. And after, you now pick one bead and then you cross with it. So because we already have three beads, the fish line in three beads, you now pick one bead and then you cross with it. Then after with the right fish line, with the right fish line, you go through the next bead. So we have it there and then you pick two beads again fix on the left fish line then you cross with the right fish line using the second bead so with the second bead you cross with the right fish line um, and then with the right fish line again you go through the next bead and then you weave that one also with the same method so you get to the end Okay, so with this side too, when you get to the end, you go through the next two beads. So the next two beads, you go through and then you cross with one bead. So you pick one bead and then you cross with it. So always remember that when you are about to turn, you go through the next two beads, then you cross with one bead. Then you turn. Then after you go through the next bead with the right fish line, then you go on and pick two beads again fix on the left fish line then you cross with the right fish line then with the right fish line you go through the next bead then you go on and weave with the same method so you get to the end of the frame So when you get to the end, you go through the next bead again. So this time we have it then on this fish line. So you pick two beads, 
fix one on this fish line then you cross with the last bead using the right fish line so you cross both sides with the last bead so you have it this way so we have the front side of the frame done but not yet done so we are going to weave a chain on this side so we can pass the picture through the side we've left here so you pick both sides of the fish line pick three beads fix one on each fish line so you fix one on the left fish line fix one on the right fish line then you cross with the last one which is the third bead you cross with it and then you still pick three beads again fix one on the left fish line fix one on the right fish line then you cross with the third bead so you go on with the same method about um, seven times so you go on about seven times yeah so i think we have seven now one two three four five six seven so we're about to do the last one so with the last one you pick one bead fix on um, each fish line so you fix one on the left fish line fix one on the right fish line then with the same fish line you go through this bead so you go through from the right side and then with the other fish line you go through from the left side as you can see i'm doing then after please pull it well to make sure it's very firm then you pass the ss fish line through So after you are done passing the fish line through, this is what you should get. And we are done with our picture frame or photo frame. So with your picture, as you can see, this is my picture. And then you are going to pass it through this side. So that's why we left that. We didn't cover that whole place. So we can pass the picture through that side and remove it anytime so you can put a picture in and remove it at any time so here is our photo frame or picture frame we are done and then you can put a glass in it if you have one please give this video a thumbs up if you want to see more of my tutorials make sure you comment and share as well Follow me on Instagram and on Facebook, subscribe to my channel and hit the bell button so you'll be notified anytime I upload a video. Thank you. See you in my next video. Have a nice day and bye.